Saturday, November 2nd, 2013, Osaka, Japan. Woke up at 6 a.m. It's about 7.30 now. Um, on the 24th floor of the Hyatt Regency Hotel. Going to be checking out at noon. I must say, I'll never get tired of this, of this view. I heard once that Howard Hughes lived for years in a hotel in Las Vegas. I think I'd rather be, if I had that kind of money, I'd rather be in a hotel like this. It's, uh... It's really incredible. Look at this huge tower next door to me. It's uh, interesting here too because we're kind of in this port community, like an island, I guess you'd call it. And uh, far, so far, far away from uh, from the downtown or any urban areas, and so you really get to see the uh, industrial traffic that, you know, what makes Kyoto, I mean, uh, Osaka, and for that matter, Japan, hum. It's uh, pretty incredible. Some of the cranes. As a Canadian, you know, from Vancouver, it really gives me a much better perspective of what we're competing against and the Japanese have really invested in the infrastructure here and uh, and they do seem to do things very efficiently maybe I'm wrong about that but I don't think so it's uh, we're striving for efficiency and often in Canada in my professional career when you make suggestions to clients to improve their efficiency they don't want to hear it and, uh, or management would like to, but the unions say no way. Because it might affect job losses for their members. Follow the money, right? Follow the money. So at noon, well actually at about 1.30, I'm going to be just north of here in a place called Shin Osaka. Just think a suburb, northern suburb. And that's where I'm catching the Shinkansen train to Fukuoka, I keep on mispronouncing it, but it's much further uh, southwest of here, and uh, it's a city of about a million people, and I won't be there very long, but it gives me, uh, I couldn't get a, a reservation at, at a hotel in Hiroshima for anything reasonable tonight, I'm just busy on the weekends, but I can tomorrow, and um, so... By staying in that city, well, I did want to visit that city, it just seemed interesting to me. And um, then it allows me to make an early morning trip into Hiroshima and spend a good solid over a day there. Uh, so there you go. So, signing out from Osaka, Japan. I love this place.